Have you seen this destruction? Doesn't this remind you of Battlefield? I mean, look at the level of destruction. This is like everything we've been asking for from EA and DICE. The whole building's collapsing, and look at this guy right here. That little bounce he gets in the end? If this doesn't scream Battlefield, I don't know what does. And look at this part. This is the actual footage, and this is it slowed down. Doesn't that remind you of the urban maps with destruction in Battlefield 3? Now this game is created by Embark Studio, and this studio is a new studio that has former DICE devs. So all the talent that you saw from Battlefield and all the crazy destruction you saw, well, the, a lot of those devs that worked on that Battlefield have moved over to Embark Studio, and that's what we're seeing here, the, one of the first games they're creating. And matter of fact, this is a free-to-play game, and it's called The Finals. Now the thing that I find interesting with trailers is always that they happen so quick and it's like almost at a blink of an eye. So I'm gonna slow it down on some parts here. They've got some incredible fire effects that are happening here. Buildings burning, destruction happening. And then out of these quick glances, you end up seeing what looks like repelling and a samurai katana. Now about this game, it looks like it's gonna be a 3v3 arena type shooter with a lot of destruction and a lot of creative ways to play because you can see here with that container they threw, it becomes like this wall of foam and more importantly, it looks like they've got a foam gun to build their own defenses and sandbox experience. But I think I'm really excited about the fact that you can have your own sandbox experience in what looks like really wicked guns, a retro kind of feel to it and a lot of destruction. So I'm looking to play this, and if you want to get in the pre-alpha or whatnot, they've just posted this today. The link's in the description. You can sign up now, see if you get lucky to get in. And boy, does this look wicked.